Today I'm going to talk about an enriched life, which you can have. It says in Luke 12, 32, It is your Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. Well, I pray that you abide in the presence of God. And I pray that your life and your days are enriched through God's divine ideas. You know, some people feel that to be prosperous is somehow unspiritual. But Jesus taught us that it is your Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. We are to trust God. Trust God for all of our supply, all of our needs. To be prosperous does not mean that some people will be less prosperous. For God's abundance is absolutely unlimited. There is plenty for all. An affirmation that I use is the one that I started with. I abide in the presence of God. My life and days are enriched through God's divine ideas. This affirmation gives us a clue as to how we are prospered. We are to pray for divine ideas. And then we're to take positive actions on the ideas that come to us. Note we're not praying for some other person to have the ideas and to do the work or to take care of us. We are to have the ideas. We are to do the work. We are to be the channels for unlimited substance. Let us open ourselves this week to enriching, prospering ideas. Before you go to bed tonight, let us thank God for God's loving, unfailing provision. And say this affirmation many times this week. I abide in the presence of God. My life and days are enriched through God's divine ideas.